Hello guys, today I'm talking about operation amplifier IT. As you can see, I have a lot of multimeters here and also I'm trying to check the single input output operation amplifiers and also this is double input output amplifiers and so you can see the um, regular formula of the um, operation amplifier is just the pin number six is output usually the question is which kind of operation amplifier we should use for the project today I will show you how to use the best or optimized operation amplifier for the circuits actually the pin number six is the output pin number four and pin number six uh, seven is connected to the ground and positive line pin number two and pin number three is a negative and positive input so we have inverting and non-inverting circuit design so here is my breadboard and here is the IC number that um, I checked with the um, I checked with the ICs so you will know exactly what kind of ICs I can check so the first chart is the IC name second one is the first regular output in voltage the second chart is um, the voltage after touching the input wire for example this as you can see I touch one paper clip here to select best and optimize configuration and the third one is touching the paper clip with the ground so as you can see I am connected the output of the circuit to the um, oscilloscope also and when I'm going to touch the paper clip you can also see the uh, output uh, with frequency and voltage for example my power source is 5 volt regulated one and it's coming from the 9 volt, the 12 volt battery and I have 10 or more a multimeter to know exactly how much voltage will be coming out from the pin number six and finally we will know exactly what number of IC is comfortable to use for the circuits as operation amplifier inverting and non-inverting so as you can see I have three IC here that they are marked by stars these ICs are sensitive and without touching the paper clip also when I'm going to close my hand to the paper clip the, the IC will affect and the voltage at the multimeter also will change okay so I will review exactly the thing that we are going to do we are going to make inverting and non-inverting operation amplifier by several ICs and after this test we will know exactly what kind of ICs is comfortable to check the operational amplifier circuits so uh, as you can see here finally I made one um, PCB project with 9 volt battery and one diode to show exactly output of device and as you can see when I'm when I'm touching the antenna or going to close this um, PCB to the 1 Hertz standard output of the oscilloscope you can see that 
I have light and it means that my IC is, is my IC is detected very well and I select the best choice for this IC for example as you can see I will review this is pin number four connected to the ground pin number seven is connected to the positive and pin number three is looped back to the negative also and just we are pin number two and enough so when i'm going to touch the pin number two you can see my voltage going to change at the start now the voltage of all multimeters are zero volt when i'm going to touch the paper clip as you can see the voltage going to 1 and 76 volt and when I'm going to connect my body to the ground it's going down to 138 1 volt and 318 millivolts so it means that this IC is very sensitive and we can use it for the pick to pick detectors or any other detectors like this so as you can as you may know if you search for the non connected voltage detector you should know exactly the operational amplifiers and the best one that i checked and normally you 741 3A3130 is regular um, operational ICs and also this is the IC type that I test and you can see the result exactly for example OP177 normally after connecting the voltage the first output without any um, usage is 1.6 volts after touching the clip is 1.03 and after connecting the ground is going down to 1.10 and also this is very sensitive IC that we can use for the, the, for the peak detectors finally the last test is using the dual op amp outputs that i tried all ic's here and also uh, you can see some smd ic's connected to the adapter to check it with dual one and also uh, i will show you exactly output of the oscilloscope when i'm touching the um, paper clip with uh, op amp you can see that I have too much activity and finally as I said before I'm going to use dual amp um, amplifier and optimize it as pick to pick detector so I will show you right now how to do this today so after using the circuit you can see the single operational amplifier and dual one how it work and this is my final test with this dual operational amplifier board you can see this is the LM1458 it's a dual operational amplifier and this PCB made by me and it, this this is finally loop of first output to second input of operational amplifier and I have very very sensitive operational amplifier that you can see before so for the test I'm going to check with this radio power on nine when I'm pushing 
for a squash you can see that I have light and also it can work for more than uh, 20 meter will detect exactly everything and finally by this test we will know which kind of the operational ICs is comfortable for our project or not. Thanks for watching and goodbye.